Hey guys, it's Havoc TBP here, or Overkill TBP, however you want to call me. So I'm, I haven't played World of Tanks in a while, and I decided I would what, tonight, anyways. So I bring my, up my Jag Panzer E100, my favorite tank. Let's go. So I look at the map where they put me. It's like a Jag Panzer E100. It's a heavy tank destroyer. It doesn't move all that gracefully. They put me on the south side of the map. I cannot make it up north in any sensible way. So I decided to go the opposite way. And I tried to play it very uh, casually, smartly. I don't know. It was, uh, I was just like, well, I'll hide in the bushes over here, which usually doesn't work anyway. You can't hide a tank destroyer. Somebody and their mother would see you from a distance. So, you know, I'm just rolling around, floating around. So I'm just doing a check along here. You know, I'm watching the mini map, seeing where possible targets are. Long distance out that way. Speed up. Ah, there she goes. So, that actually helped us. My little snapshot on that AMX 1390. I even got complimented on that, you know. Some people, it's like, what the hell is a Jaggy 100 doing out in this corner? But, you watch the fucking battle. Sorry, excuse my language. You watch the battle, and the whole north almost got, they got slaughtered. And I'm over here by my lonesome with the uh, Bat Chat, and uh, I think there was a, uh, there, there's the EMX. And got the Bat Chat and the EMX over that way. Down yonder. Oh, look, another target. Nah, he decided to run off. I was looking at him for a while. Yeah, you know, even just watching me roll around with a slug, <laughs> you watch the mini map like death, death. There's deaths everywhere. Our team is faltering big time. He was like, okay, you know, I'm the slow slug, be patient. But my position is the interesting part too. Tank destroyers don't roll this way. You never see a fucking Jaggy 100 up this way. And there was no way in hell I was going to make it up that hill to be able to useful, any use, because they spawned me south of the flag. So I was like, no, I'm not going to race uphill the entire way with the slow-ass tank. So I said, you know what, I'm just going to go uphill and go this way. So I push it. I made a judgment call, and I was like, I'm just going to go. Who do I got to fight with? Any target I see is going to get lit up. The Bat Chat 25 is with me, and the AMX was low health, but he was still alive. Actually, he did help a couple. So I just said, Yeah, look, the noobs. He goes, Wow, Jackie 100. 
brave move. <laughs> I, I really didn't have time to reply. But it worked. <laughs> that rev took off like a bat out of hell as soon as he saw that thing go down. Some good shots, lower HP, and that was it. So yeah, we had two Arties left on our team on the you know our side of the map. It's just uh, three actual tanks basically on the other side with me, the Batchet, and the AMX. He's still alive. I think I, had, I don't remember getting a kill on this guy, but. I think I did. Double kill. So yeah. And the spots. I got the spots on the Arties. So there's two Arties gone. So Well, we sat there and wait for a minute anyway. My HP is, you know, primary factor in this too. I didn't really go down at all. <laughs> Except I kicked some ass. You know, feasibly, you know, tank destroyers are supposed to be in the back of the line anyway. I just went the other line. You know, I swung around for the flank. But watching the map, you know, they started pushing. You know, tortoise and the they started pushing the F one two lines. I was like, ah shit! They took out one of our arties. I said, all right, well maybe I'll just head back to the other side. These guys are just chatting up the storm here. I'm figuring the bat chat can handle the GW tiger. So he was like, why was I worried about going after him? Might as well go back for the flag. Besides, they were both low HP anyway. And I'm the only high roller HP in here. Just figured, hey, you know, why not go after the other two tank destroyers? I'm not a pushover. I can handle it. They actually, um, well, I just, uh, you know... I was goofing around anyway, the whole battle. I was like, well, I'll just go this way. I'll go this way. I'll go this way. You know? I didn't know really what I was doing, like, strategically, because everybody... I played a battle earlier when I was on West Westfield or uh, Mountain Pass. I was on Mountain Pass, and I was the only one that went Iceland side with this tank. And I was able to hold the line against an E-100, a Jag Tiger, and... Uh, a conqueror. And I was like, okay. Enemy armor is hit. So, yeah. So I nailed the stir. Look at me blocking some damage. Ping pong. <laughs> I love when a jag blocks shots. <laughs> They were like, reset it, reset it. <laughs> that was working at it. <laughs> the engine is smoking. Enemy armor is damaged.
<laughs> and that is the end of that. <laughs> Good battle. That's Havoc TVP doing a recording. Thanks for watching. Peace.